moped crime crackdown, Theresa May vows to boost police powers to tackle surgeon attacks. In a major victory for the Daily Express crusade to give police the powers to tackle the growing menace of mope gangs, Theresa May has pledged she will ensure police will be get what they need to pursue the criminals. Speaking for the first time on the issue since the Express forced former Home Secretary Amber Rudd to hold a review on the new form of crime, Mrs. May, who was Home Secretary before entering 10 Downing Street, insisted she had not lost control of Britain streets. Her words came as a 24-year-old woman in London was left in a critical state this week after an attack by a criminal on a moped. She was attacked by a gang who stole her mobile phone in Edgware Road. The latest figures that there are 60 moped gang attacks a day in the capital. Police have felt unable to pursue the attackers because of health and safety rules and questions over insurance cover if they were involved in an accident. Campaigners backed by the Daily Express have pushed for police to be given the necessary protection to tackle the crime wave which has been linked to acid attacks as well as mobile phone and other thefts. Speaking to the Daily Express at the G7 summit in Quebec, Mrs. May said, This issue of moped crime is one that is of concern for people. That's why the former Home Secretary, Amber Rudd, brought in the police and talked with them about various issues and ways in which we could be helping the police to actually be dealing with it. That's why one of the things we are looking at in terms of the pursuit police are able to make of these people actually ensuring they have got the powers that they need. It will mean they are able to pursue them and able to take the action we agree that they want to take. The Prime Minister also defended her record on law and order mid concerns that the government and police have lost control of the streets in a week where the murder rate in London was higher than New York. Mrs May has come under criticism for her actions as Home Secretary reducing stop and search which is now linked to the rise in knife crime. Recently, the new Home Secretary Sajid Javid urged the police to start using stop and search powers again. Defending her record, Mrs May said, let me be very clear about stop and search. Stop and search is a very important tool for the police. What I said to the police was that they should do it and use it lawfully because what we found from the chief inspector's report was about a quarter of stops and searches were being done effectively illegally. It is an important tool but do it lawfully. The Prime Minister also personally praised the Daily Express's campaign. She said, the danger posed by thugs on mopeds on the streets has been vividly highlighted by the Daily Express. This is a menace the government working with the police is determined to tackle.